I came to realize was that the problem with self graphics was that it was a building that was 15,000 square feet, but now was into its fourth generation of artists. So, so the building hadn't gotten any bigger. The resources hadn't gotten any bigger, but now we have four times as many artists. So obviously you had the younger artists saying, well, you know, there, there's no room for younger artists, you know, it's only the old people, you know, the same old faces get to print there. And they had the young, new, older oh. artists saying, you know, you know, they don't call us anymore, and they just want new stuff, and you know, and, you know the veteranos, and you know, we, we don't get to print there anymore. Well, they were kind of both right, you know. Um, and I took that into consideration in fashioning how we were going to invite artists to come so that we really make it as, as much as possible, get from the younger, the older, you know, middle, this, you know, various groups, various sectors, you know, uh, so that people feel included in this process. Um, and um, began a very aggressive sales of, of prints, um, sold, you know, uh, we made one sale of over 100 prints to Ultimate, uh, very, very successful for, for self-help graphics. Um, um, Ultimate also wanted to buy paintings. self help doesn't deal in paintings, but I said, you know what? I'll do it. I'll get the artist, and but self help will get twenty five percent, or twenty percent. Sorry, twenty percent. Self help got twenty percent of. I, I sold all the work, and gave the the, the, the commission will be the, the commission to 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 self help graphics. Um, at the end of the three years, uh, we had erased. The, the deficit in July of 2008 when I stepped down as president of self Graphics we had erased the deficit and we had $116,000 in the bank with another $60,000 in receivables so I essentially left leaving self-help the exact opposite of where I found it.